Now, Trade Cabinet Secretary Moses Kuria on Thursday, September 21, launched an industrial park in Bondo, Siaya County. In his speech, Kuria, who has been in the recent past exchange bitter words with a section of the UDA leaders, reminisced on his relationship with the family of the first Vice President of Kenya, Jaramogi Oginga Odinga. He narrated how former Prime Minister Ilo Odinga's father saved him from being kicked out of the University of Nairobi, UON. He said this and I quote, On 20th January 1994, we were here a whole 29 years ago to bury Jaramogi Oginga Odinga, the man who instructed Senator Tieno Kajuang to represent me in court and get an injunction that stopped me from being expelled from the UON. End of quote. Moses Kuria went ahead to drop a clearest hint that he will dump President William Ruto for position leader El Odinga in the next general election. Moses Kuria said that even though there was no election in the near future, the spoken trade cabinet secretary are Nyanza leaders led by Raila Odinga's elder brother Oburu Odinga to focus on development and that he might work with them in the next general election. He said this and I quote, Hakuna uchaguzi mwaka huu na hakuna mwaka ujao. So let us focus on development. Can't we keep ourselves busy by focusing on development then? When the next election comes, we decide now the time is over. We go back to other things, and if possible, even those ones, we leave them behind and we forge together. End of quote. Kuria's remarks comes just few days after the Kenya Kwanza government directed the Ministry of Trade to move its offices from the Two Rivers Mall back to the 17th floor of the NSSF building. Although the government noted that the offices were being relocated back to the building owned by the state pension fund to trim its expenses in line with the recent austerity directives, the directive was meant to clip the wings of the outspoken CAs who is known to speak his mind. This is some Cuban news.